Hello, beautiful world. And by beautiful world, I mean the people who cough into the elbow. You know, good people like me, the open mouth coughers and the hand coughers are just evil. Now, how does a vegan get sick? One, she stays in bed pretty much all winter, not going out anywhere, so her immune system gets weak and her body's not used to the viruses going around. Two, when she does decide to go out, she makes the mistake of making her first outing a seminar where there are hundreds of people. Now at the seminar, I was sitting in the front row. There was a lady sitting beside me Let's just call her evil being. And the speaker was in this direction. Now, because this evil being was facing towards the speaker, she was basically in my direction. Now, she was heckling the speaker this entire time that he was up there and just saying things that were not even useful. They were just random and I could see the frustration every time she did it in this guy's face because he just tried to keep ignoring it. He didn't even acknowledge what she was saying the entire time. Just annoying heckles. None of them at all funny. Like a few years ago, Ron Funches had a show in Toronto that I went to, I was in the front row, and he was making a joke about massaging his banana! And how he used coconut oil, and how his banana is so soft and smooth now. And I heckled, I said, never have chap lips again. Now he heard me, he asked me to repeat it, and he thought it was hilarious. This evil being at the seminar was nothing like that. Not hilarious at all. Now, at some point, she decided to cough in my direction. Not an elbow cough, because, like I said, she's an evil being. Not a hand cough, because, well, she's extremely evil. But an open mouth cough in my direction. <coughs> <clears throat> and now I'm sick. Yes, even vegans can get sick. Especially when you're a lazy aster in winter like me. Now, I have this evil being to thank for me feeling so... <clears throat> yeah, this is her doing. Now you guys kind of have Tal Fishman to thank for this video because before recording this video, I had my morning nap. Now, of course, before I passed out from my morning nap, I was watching a bunch of reaction time videos. So, that's definitely why I dreamt about him. So basically, in my morning nap, Val Fishman was basically my Mr. Miyagi. He taught me how to swish and flick, just like Professor Flitwick. Teaching me the ways of YouTube and how to have awesome videos. Destry Smith was also in my videos, teaching me how to have a variety of different facial expressions. Jenna was there too. You know, Jenna Marbles, the most awesome human being. She was encouraging me a lot. She was clapping, and somehow her dogs were clapping too. Yeah, I have interesting dreams when I'm sick. Now, if you like that, please come back for more. Like, subscribe, and be sure to tell your friends. I swear it's not a chore. Be sure to check out my other channels. My health channel, my vlog channel, and my gaming channel. My health channel for tips and tricks on being vegan and to learn more about my epilepsy. My vlog channel to see what I'm up to every day. And my gaming channel for awesome playthroughs and wonderful streaming. I love you guys so, so, so much.